Everybody's been Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do as round one is underway. Well, here we are watching a counter puncher tonight, Teddy. And, you know, it's easy to see what he wants to do. But what does he do when the other guy isn't cooperating, when he's not giving him these opportunities to counter punch? Well, that's absolutely right. Then if he's not getting cooperation, he can't be a counter puncher. He has to turn into being a guy who gets off first, who does it on the front end, who creates his own. Kind of reminds you a little bit of the D. La Hoya Mayweather fight. You know, D. La Hoya, when he stayed on the outside and used that long reach and that jab, you knew you had a terrific counter puncher in Mayweather, but there was nothing for Mayweather to counter. There was nothing there. It's when De La Hoya was not smart. There was a lot of spots where he wasn't, where he just walked in. Then he gave up that ability, and he allowed the counter puncher to have his way. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Able to block that away. It was targeted for his head. Working well that time. Hands of Stone's blocking ability is doing well for him there. Let's see some more head. Bam Bam's right hand did a nice job that time. That worked well for him. Hands of Stone is able to avoid that punch. Nice work doubling up that jab. This is yours. Here we go. Round two is underway. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Takes a step back. Then the counter punch by Hands of Stone. Very similar to what you see Floyd Mayweather do. You know, make a miss, pull that shoulder back, and then come right back with the counter. Bam Bam's defense is now serving him well. Nice job blocking that punch. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. Bam Bam showing that walking stick right now, utilizing the jab. at him with a left hand. <laughs> Halfway through this round here. You see, he comes over the top with that right hand, a real solid shot. Bam Bam's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Keep working the body. Oh, he just misses with that headshot. Final 10 seconds of round number two. And that's the end of round two. And round number three is underway. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Targeting that head with the combination punching. Hands of Stone's knowledge of the game is showing through. Three ways to defend. One of them is to block. He did it there well. Watch the hook. Let's do it. Bam Bam swinging and missing like he's at bat right there. That punch was nowhere near his opponent. And there's the left hand working well for him again. Good flush shot upstairs.
Right, unable to connect. There you go. You know what you do. Locks away that headshot. Keep doing what you're doing. And once again, he returns fire up top. Snaps that jab out. Hands of Stone's movement's really helping him out, avoiding that punch. It's okay, let's go. Nice block that time. It was intended to the head. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by Hands of Stone. Way to hit the target there. Jab uppercut. All right. All right. Round number four underway. Bam Bam's just dominating in the punch stat categories. When you look at total punches thrown, he's got a big edge early on. Yeah, not a lot of damage going on, but as you just said, one guy working, the other guy's not. Do you see any way in which he can take his opponent's aggression and turn it against him? Yeah, the perfect way. I mean, boxing 101, counterpunching. You got a guy coming at you, no better way than to change his mind. Make him miss, make him pay. You got this one. Not able to land the headshot. Ninety seconds to go in round number four. There's that overhand right. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Keep it going. Keep moving. Keep moving. And now just wasting away some time with that clinch. How about a return to sender with the left hand? Lands the counter. Needs to improve that accuracy. Missed with the headshot. Committing to the body work now. He lands the right hand. Just Knifing up with that uppercut by Hands of Stone. This has been a very entertaining fight. A little time to reflect here at the end of this round. My thoughts being this. I would really be surprised if we go to a decision. It just has that kind of feel to me. Yeah, it has a feel to me like going to one of those places where you can eat all the pasta you can for one price, you know? And some guys get carried away. They eat about five bowls. Well, these guys, they're gonna have a stomach ache at the end. Somebody is gonna wind up not standing at the end. And he just turns that hook up top and it does damage. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Hands of Stone. If there was a baseball umpire around, he'd call that a strikeout by Hands of Stone. Good work, toe-to-toe -to -toe there. Both fighters got in on him. It worked in the box. Bam Bam's not just loading up. He's landing combination punches like he did right there. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Don't let him get to you, kid. Yeah. Nice job to land that counter punch and getting away from one of his own by hands of stone. He missed with that headshot. Bam Bam's right hand scores well that time.
give him a lot of credit for even getting up from that knockdown, but he still has to impress and move forward here. Yeah, I applaud him. I give him credit, but I also recognize that he's in good shape. That's one of the reasons he got up. Bam Bam's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. It has been completely one-sided so far tonight, and he's in control as we start this round. those headshots with his defense up top. A little head hunting with the right. And just grabbing on to his opponent. Bam Bam's giving his opponent headaches here now. He's throwing punches, but he's able to block them away. And now he's acting like a fighter. Coming. Wow, what a right hand he just got caught. Oh, that's got to hurt. Can he get up from this? He's done it before, but can he get up from a second time down? away worked again knockout victory for him by way of knockouts your winner That's how you end a fight right there. Yes, he was controlling throughout.